episode of Lug Team Outdoorsman. Today we're going to be doing a, a video on this brand new Yak Attack light that I bought, the Yak Attack Vizi Carbon Pro LED light and flag combo. So as you guys know, I originally bought the Yak Power lightning rod. Um, you guys saw a video on that a, a few months ago. Um, I did not have a great experience with that flag. Uh, it started failing almost the second or third trip out. Um, and then I got a new one and that one was completely un unusable. It didn't work. Um, so I ended up just going for the new one. Um, I don't hate Yak Power, but I just didn't have great experience with that one. They make a lot of good products though. But today we're going to be trying the Yak Attack version. This is the Vizi Carbon Pro. So they have a couple different options of it. I think it's the Vizi Carbon Pro, which is obviously a carbon shaft. Um, and they have the Vizi Pole, which I think is just a fiberglass. So I went with the better option of the two. Costing around a hundred bucks. Um, but this one is not um, plug in. So you, you don't plug this one in. This one's double A powered, um, just battery powered. And it should last me well over a hundred hours of life. So yeah, well guys, we're, we're gonna give this a shot. I think this one will do a little bit better. Um, this one seems a lot more durable, a lot more waterproof. We're gonna get this open right now and take a look. Okay, so on the packaging, you got all your features right here. Improve, uh, enhances visibility to 360 degrees day or night. Um, 48 inch collapsible pole. Uh, 100 hours of lifespan, 10,000 plus hours of LED life, so that's a lot of time. Uh, and then 100 hours on three AA batteries that are included. Um, carbon fiber and, and a flag that comes with it as well. So, and a foam base that'll fit my Yak Attack mounts. So, that's a better picture of it right there. We're going to get it out of the box. Then you got that cool flag on there as well. Yeah, let's pop this open. So, you got your Yak Attack sticker right there. Cool little sticker. Here we go. So we got a mount there. We won't be using this mount, but I do have this mount available for me to use. And then this looks like it's all together actually. So let me pop this guy out. There we go. All right. Okay. So we got our main unit here. So that's the flag I just dropped for you. Definitely a thinner piece of, definitely a thinner mast or shaft, or whatever you want to call it. Definitely thin. But honestly, it doesn't seem too, too bad. So let's pop this thing open. There we go. All right. Oh, yeah. Oh, sweet. It automatically just pops into place. Okay. Okay. Sweet. All right. Cool. And then you got your, you got your Yak Attack mount right there to add to any track mount or this base here that you want to add. All right, then we'll get this flag on there. Now the flag is on. And you got your little protective base here. It's foam. And then, is there anything else in the box? Nothing else in the box. And let's see if the battery is already in there. So I think I'm supposed to twist this. You got your two LEDs right here. You can upgrade this to four LEDs actually if you want to, a little bit brighter. If you want. And then I think you just put it in. Tighten it down a little bit. There we go. Now look at that. So that's, that should be plenty bright enough. And then like I said, you can always upgrade it to a four LED if you wanted to do that as well. But yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm six foot three. This thing is about that tall. So really probably about three and a half to four feet probably tall, which is fine. That should be plenty, but yeah. And then fully collapsible as well. So you can quickly collapse it and then it'll just go right back into position. It's got little bungees in between each part of the stick. So you can just quickly reassemble it. But this thing's pretty cool. And it's got that nice reflective strip there. You got your Yak Attack logo right there, but let's just go see how this looks on, on the kayak.
All right, guys, that's going to do it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. This thing was super easy to set up. This video is not going to be nearly as long as our other unboxings and assemblies, mainly because it was super easy to assemble, super easy to unbox, and super easy to set up. So this thing is a really hassle-free flag. Um, really super easy. All you got to do is just twist in, and then the light turns on. And then you just untwist it just a little bit, and then it turns off. So it's really that simple, guys. Not really much more to this than you got your little tracks on the bottom. But yeah, guys, that's going to do it for today's video. Uh, I really hope you guys enjoy, and then we'll see how this thing holds up long term. See you guys in the next video.